What's up guys, we're here today with another episode of Kelly's Road to Sponsorship. This one's a little bit different because Kelly went on his own and filmed a couple tricks. This is three separate tricks that Kelly did when he was out on his own, and I want you guys to give feedback on the tricks, which ones you like the best, which ones you think should go in the part, be left out of the part, etc. And then if you guys have tricks that you feel like you should learn next, leave it in the comment below. What's going on guys? I'm here for episode four of Kelly's Road to Sponsorship, and I'm here with my friend Gunner. And he's gonna film me today, and uh, I'm gonna try a trick on this little, I guess handrail. I don't know really what else to call it. Yeah, it's definitely. But handrail. I've really never hit a street rail, and I'm gonna try to like front board it. I think so. It's gonna be kind of sketch. Very. Yeah. This is such a short handrail. Oh my god. You know, it's short, but there's a kink. There's a kink. So that's I've never hit a kink it's a, either. It's a long kink. But uh. I'm gonna give it my best. Hopefully I won't sack. I don't think I can sack. If you sack on this, probably not gonna get sponsored. Not gonna probably mind. not. All right, I'm gonna warm up and uh, go for it. Okay, so I'm gonna try and see if it's sackable. Okay. <laughs> We're good, guys. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> Dang, I'm gonna hit these. This bush too, it's gonna be sick. Wait, where'd you get that wax? Dude, is that too much? I'm really scared. Now I'm gonna put, slip put. out. Oh. Nice. What happens if I commit right here? I'll give you a kick hat. What do you give to me if I uh, land a first try, Gunner? First try? I'll, I'll give you. Dude. I'll, my mom will make you a meal every single day. Oh my god. I don't feel like I'm gonna pop You will. That was really close. Oh, oh I was about to do that one. Like, I like committed, but then I failed. Like, really weird. Dang it. Dude, that is so nice. The kink sounds really good. You're gonna get it. Ha, that was it. No. No. Yeah. I don't know how great that was, by the way. <laughs> the filming. I don't know how great. I'm so hyped right now. That was sick, actually. Right. That was sick. Let's watch it back. The key of this trick was just making sure I was zoned in and not worrying about the kink at all and just focusing on rolling away because that's really what it came down to and just committing every time and not like, oh, I don't know if I should do this one because I, you know, was distracted or something. I just went for it every time so I made sure I was going to get the result I want to and uh, I got to th thank my boy Gunner. What's up? Filmed me today. I got to say. No, it didn't actually take me that long. Way shorter than like the line at Waller in the previous episode or whatever. I want to thank Gunner. You can follow him at G Nozzle on Instagram. I'm here again for episode four of Kelly's Road Sponsorship. And I'm here with my friend Luke over there. We're gonna get some uh, tricks today at these ledges. These ledges may look nice and perfect, but they're really hard to skate because they're not like as square as normal ledges. They're kind of round. So like, 
certain tricks are gonna be harder on this. Let's warm up and then go for it. I'm gonna try a no side big spin. Let's get it. Woo! That was it. Got it. I understand how to do it. Alright, last chance for an owl drink, extra large. Not too much. You got it right here. So close. Ow. All right. I'm done. We got the clip. It was, I wouldn't say sketchy, but it wasn't perfect. So I might not put it in that final sponsor tape. I gotta give a huge thanks to my man Luke. I think we might have filmed this trick for maybe an hour hour and a half, I don't know. But you should follow his Instagram, at Luke underscore Ike. Just go follow him. Luke and I are at the next spot, uh, and it's the same day as the last trick. And uh, I'm gonna try a trick down this grass gap, and I'm gonna try a, a double flip. So let's warm up with the double flip on flat, then I'll ollie the gap, and then I'll, we'll just go right into it. Double kick flips on flat for me are a little tough, but I think down a gap with a little bit more air time, I could uh, get the full rotation and be able to do it. I've done a double kick flip down like a two stair, but this is a little bit bigger, so we'll see what happens. I basically landed that one footed, so now I have the confidence to put both feet on, so let's commit. If you land it right here, I'll buy you a new deck. Oh, sorry. Oh. Oh. One of the things I noticed after trying like many tricks over however long I've been skating is that you always gotta stay positive, otherwise you're never gonna land it. So, quick tip, words of wisdom from Kelly. Bro, you have it. Oh, oh yeah. Nice. So hyped right now. I'm, I've never really double flipped anything, and that was a big accomplishment for me. And I gotta thank Luke. He filmed two tricks for me today, both taking a, an average of an hour. And hey, we uh, got it. We got it done. Thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe to the Braille channel. You can also subscribe to my channel. Uh, there'll be a, either a, a link on my face or in the description. Follow Luke at Luke Ike. I'll uh, put it on the screen right now. We'll see you next time. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Don't forget to leave in the comments below your suggestions. That's super helpful for us. We'll read them out in the next video.
and um, you guys should follow Kelly on his YouTube channel. He's an up and comer and he helps out a lot here at Braille, so definitely deserves the support. You should follow our channel, subscribe, like, leave a comment below. We'll see you next time. Peace. Definitely check out Skateboarding Made Simple. It's available on all these platforms, iBooks, BrailleSkateboarding.com, and Google Play. It's the most comprehensive video we've ever made and it teaches skateboarding better than anything else out there. You won't be disappointed.